be a gold digger, then you can own the mine. <laughs> That's such a good line. Pants down is one of the stars of The Real Housewives of Toronto. Not to mention a CEO, motivational speaker, author, mom of eight as well, and Catherine's here to share her favorite anti-aging foods and ways to easily incorporate them into your daily routine. It smells amazing. Good morning, Good, Good morning. morning. Good morning. Well, let's get started with your own personal story that you shared on the reality show where your well-known husband, Dr. Yes. Stephen Mulholland, yes. you actually changed his life around through diet. He Over lost a lot of weight. He is half the man he used to be. <laughs> Amazing. Yes. And men can How, how much stubborn. did he lose? I went about 48 pounds. Wow. And just switching what he pounds. eats. Switching what he eats. So he took out all the like heavy carbs, and he still eats a lot of protein, eats a lot of vegetables, and he watches what he eats. Okay. So you're very yes. mindful as to what mm -hmm. we put into our bodies. And you, you're sharing some tips and some recipes, because you also love to cook on top of everything else Raj mentioned. Mm -hmm. I love to cook. Right. So let's talk about... Some of these recipes. First up, what are we making? This is my okay, first time Okay, we're going to do this. this. So I like eating with purpose. I like eating a lot, but I eat with purpose. So everything I put in my body has to do work. Yeah. And the main thing I want to do is skin. And so things like pomegranate will stimulate collagen. And so we're, we're going to do this. You put the rice in there. We're going to okay. talk about that in a sec. Okay. Just push a lot in there. This oh, a is lot a rice more? cuber. Rice okay. cuber. So collagen um, is stimulated by pomegranate. So I'll eat pomegranate in the morning. Mm -hmm. Actually, we'll eat a whole pomegranate and go... Do your work, do your work, do your work. Or I'll eat blueberries. And this is a blueberry drink. This is only blueberry. Because the antioxidants and the vitamin C. Antioxidants, vitamin C, great for stimulating collagen. Are, are there times when you want to do skin. it too? Are there times when you want to eat it or does it matter? No, I Just do it, it first thing in the morning. And my husband, who is a doctor, says this is not true. But I do the layers. The first layer has to be the blueberries or celery uh, like pureed. That's it. We're hearing a lot about the uh, celery drink. So why is it so great? Is it the same? It's uh, anti-inflammatory and okay. so it's supposed to be like a superfood. I do prefer the blueberries for skin as it for celery is supposed to do a good job. Right. Okay. So load up yeah. on those pomegranate, broccoli. Yeah. You, you've talked Tons about broccoli. broccoli. I love but two of my weddings I had broccoli bouquets. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Now, those are foods you prefer. Do you, do you have a variety or do you stick to, to certain ones, try, you know, proven ones that you love and like? Um, you mean the wedding bouquets? No, well, the wedding or the bouquets. Husbands. And the husbands. Well, or the <laughs> like, food. I thought yeah. we were talking about food. Right. How did we get to husbands again? All right. Your son loves broccoli. He loves it. He I devours broccoli. broccoli. And devours so it. I boil water and then I put the broccoli in for like three seconds. I take it out, cool it off in cold water, and then I add it at the very end at whatever I'm making. Okay. And so I don't cook the broccoli in sauce. Got and so it's it. always al dente. Right. And it's always bright and vibrant. Because you don't want it overcooked. And, it doesn't taste good. And you good. don't boil it in the water. The water's already going boiled. Deep. So you push it in. Now you got to You got to yeah. close it. Now squish it together. Squishing it. Squishing it. it I mean, it, it looks so pretty. I, I've never done this before. Here. Okay. So okay. you squish it together. So there you've got well, there like a is. cube like that. Yes. And then you can open it up. And then we so are lightly. What kind of lightly. rice do you use? Does it matter? That's sushi rice. And sushi it has vinegar in there and rice vinegar and sugar in there. Perfect. And there now, you've got a cube. Some people say we should stay away from rice, and you looked at me. Well, you're three feet away. Yeah, <laughs> I'm away from it. <laughs> but you, uh, you embrace rice. I like it just as an appetizer or something, mm -hmm. so I don't eat rice like with every single meal. Mm -hmm. I, like, I love these rice squares. The kids love them. And so instead of having pasta and things like that, it's a nice little oh. filler food. This is cooked. The rice is cooked. You've got your avocado. Just mushed mm. up on top and chopped up onion. And then you would take that to eat it. You can pick one up, dip it in the soy sauce. Now, that's gluten-free soy sauce. You know I'm going By the way, I have avocado every day. Another thing that really helps with your skin Great from the inside skin. out. Yeah. So good for the skin. It is really good. What did good. you make here? How pretty this is that? This is meatless meatballs. And this is gluten-free pasta. So you're going to have spaghetti and meatballs. It's another way to do I'm it. What here. a way to present it. It's adorable. So, it's so, so yeah. these are the meatless meatballs with some, you know, parsley and garlic and onion. Yeah. And then you've got your pasta swirled around there. So you're not doing too much pasta. I yeah. find pasta kind of a waste of eating. Right. And so if people love pasta. Do the gluten-free pasta and just a little bit. The presentation is gorgeous. Now, what did you do with your broccoli there? That broccoli is done with a curry, mm. a green curry and peanut sauce. So half peanut sauce spicy and half green curry. Yum. So much and flavor. So there's a lot of flavor. And look at the salad because you never spinach you never miss salad. that on taste, right? That spinach salad. And that has a miso dressing and it's got a yuzu. Okay. So yuzu. Truffle oil and olive oil, just a little bit of each on top, 
and then it, you can make your own miso. I buy the miso. I've tried making it. It's not as good as the bought miso, okay. but you can just spread it on in a pan and dehydrate mm. it in the oven. I love how simple these are. Right? They're all simple, but you pre-make all the ingredients ahead of time. So we have jars and jars in our fridge that has the, the miso already pre-made and dried. It has sesame seeds. It has um, pre uh, almonds all slivered up and so that yeah. you can just grab these things and then you can put your meal together. Because I was going to say you're a CEO, you know your husband's got his practice, you have eight kids in the house, how do you make yeah. sure because it's so easy to try and go the fast yeah, food route right. or whatever yeah. and it's all in jars, the meal prep. Jars and jars of healthy food on the counter. Okay. They have no choice. Smart. And getting but into I do, the habit of that. I do find under the cushion, like you sit on the sofa, and then you find like <laughs> a wrapper. I, so I know they're I know they're cheating. Sneaking in a tree. But, but I think that's what you okay. want, especially for the kids, you want them to at least recognize it and eventually down the road they start embracing they it. They right? do. The right? older ones are really healthy eaters and they are super, super fit. And you feel better, like you said, Raj, Absolutely. when you changed your diet around, Raj also lost thirty pounds. Yeah. You said you yeah. didn't miss the other stuff. No, eating clean was more enjoyable than eating yeah. some of the products. Processed foods, yeah. without Do a doubt. Do you find when you don't eat clean that it comes out in your pores? Yes. Like, can you feel it? And yeah, you, you absolutely cream. feel it. Yeah. And yeah. you can crave we drink good this? food. Yeah. Can we drink this? Cheers to good health from the inside uh -oh. out. And this is just blueberry pureed. That's what could go wrong? What, what's going to go wrong? I want to watch the mustache on you. Mm. Wow, well done. I must ask you a question. <laughs> How's my mustache? Thanks, Sam. <laughs> Cheers to good health. Breakfasttelevision.ca. That's delicious. Cheers. Mm. Be mindful. Cheers. 2020. Or BT, That's it. Come on. You, you want some rush? Right?